All right, number eight. Again, sorry for the lighting. So number eight says, Jane paid $40 for an item after she received 20% discount. Jane's friend says this means the original price of the item was $48. How do you think Jane's friend arrived at this amount? Okay, so looking at this, I have to figure out what um, I have to figure out what, why Jane friend thought that it was going to be $48 of the original price. And what I think Jane friend did was she calculated what 20% of 40 would be. So I think what she did was she said, okay, 20% of... 40 equals so when you ever you're taking 20% just know 20% is the same thing as 20 hundredths which is the same thing as two tenths which we also can represent as a decimal so point two okay and of whenever we're trying to find a fraction or a percent of something that means multiplication so point two of 40 then we just multiply this just regular multiplication 2 times 0, 0, 2 times 4, 8, and then there's one number behind the decimal, so there should be always be one number behind your decimal, so 8. So 20% of 40 is actually 8. So what I think the friend thought was, oh, 20% off of 40, that means that 20% of 40 is 8, so then you just add the 40 plus the 8 to get 48, but actually, the friend was incorrect. So it comes back here and it says, is the friend correct? And the answer is no. The friend's not correct. The friend told you what 20% of 40 was. She doesn't know what the original price is. Um, and I'm going to show you how to find the original price right now. So give me a second. Three, six. All right. So think about it this way. We don't know what the original price is. We have no idea what it is. But we do know is we know that she got 20% discount. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to use this tape diagram and I'm going to split it into 20%. Um, and the whole thing is worth 100%. So that means I'm going to split it into five equal boxes. So think about it. This is 20%, 40%, 60%, 80%, 100%. And we don't know how much the entire thing costs together, but we do know that she got a 20% discount. That means she didn't pay for one of these 20% because each of these are worth 20%. And we do know that she did pay $40. So since she paid $40 and we know she paid 80% because if she didn't pay, if she got a 20% discount, that means she subtract 20, she paid 80%. 100, 20% from 100% is 80%. So we see that there's one, two, three, four boxes and four, $40 split by four boxes means that 20% would have been $10 because there's four equal boxes and all these boxes are worth the same value. So she paid $40 and she got this 20% discount, this 20% also would have been worth $10. And the reason why is because each of these boxes, this is 0%, is worth 20%. And she, even though she got that discount, that means that, they, that um, she got $10 off. I hope this makes sense. Um, please ask questions below if you're still confused. Thank you. Bye.